Hi friends, I am Uncle Chatur and today I'll speak to you about helium. Most of the gases found in nature can be prepared in the laboratory. But there are a few gases that are found only in nature. Helium is one such gas. It is an inert gas which is orderless and tasteless due to its unusual characteristics. Helium is very useful gas. It is the second lightest gas next to hydrogen but unlike hydrogen it is non-inflammable. An English scientist Sir Joseph Norman Lockyer and a French chemist Pierre Janssen independently discovered helium gas in 1868. While studying the solar spectrum to find the elements present in the sun, they came across some lines that were not observed earlier. These lines suggested the presence of a new element in the sun. This element was named helium after the Greek god Helios, meaning the sun. Many scientists tried to detect the presence of helium in the Earth's atmosphere. They detected very small quantities of helium in the atmosphere. Did you know that atmospheric air contains only one part of helium in 186,000 parts that is 0.0005239%. Due to its lightness and non-inflammability, helium is used in weather balloons. It is also used to ease the breathing difficulties in asthmatic patients. Deep sea divers are given a mixture of oxygen and helium for breathing so that after coming back they do not suffer from the bends. Helium is also used to weld aluminum. A mixture of helium and neon is used to produce laser beams. Helium can be liquefied at minus 268.9 degrees Celsius or 4.2 K. Liquid helium is used in low temperature work. There are some places in America such as Texas, New Mexico, Kansas, etc. where the amount of helium present in the atmosphere often goes up to 8%. It is also present in the atmosphere in Canada, Africa and the Sahara Desert. America is the world's richest source of helium and is therefore the biggest seller of helium to other nations. In earlier times this gas was very expensive but now it has become quite cost effective. That's all for today. Take good care of yourself and people around you. Bye bye.